your girl Duchess Kiki. I wanted to come and do this video before I wash this makeup off my face. I was like, let me come on and show you guys a hair update. Um, I'm supposed to retighten uh, on next week. And I wanted you to see, first of all, see my hang time back here. Hold on, let me put my ponytail back in. My hang time back there, y'all see that? She's getting long. And my hair has changed a lot, okay? Let me give you some better lighting. Okay, there we go. My hair has changed a lot. When I say a lot, it has changed a lot. Um, as you can see, it has gotten long, y'all. Look at that. It's gotten really, really long. I want y'all see the back. Um, Y'all see the back? Yeah. It has gotten really, really long and thick. It's gotten thicker and it's gotten longer all at the same time. So, um, yeah. It is really, 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 really gotten thick i haven't been doing anything to it though not at all i haven't been doing nothing because yeah but i have seen a lot of my ends look at my ends now a lot of them are a lot of them are sealing um there's a lot that's not but there's a lot that is sealing um I thought about doing another trim because y'all did that. Y'all know when I did that trim in um no in September, I told y'all I said I'm gonna trim my ends and watch my hair grow really fast. So as you can see, I told y'all I was gonna go through a growth spurt and I did. As you can see, I went through a major growth spurt, major growth spurt, y'all. I went through a major growth spurt. As you can see. It's, it's um, a major growth spurt. So, that's what's going on with the hair. What's this right here? Like, you can tell I haven't done anything to it. Look at this right here. It's thinning right here. I just noticed that. So I'm going to leave that alone. I'm going to let it fall off on its own. But that's the only one. I haven't re went through them since my last retightening. But since my last retightening, I noticed like it's gotten thick, especially on the ends, man. And I noticed that on my last retightening, um, how thick it has gotten. So... Um, I believe I'm supposed to retighten either next week or the week after. Um, so, yeah, I didn't, um, my edges, I did retighten my edges so I could look a little decent for my grandma's funeral. But that was all I did, and the rest I didn't retighten. So, as you can see, um, a lot of that is going on. That piece is going to aggravate me now that I found that piece. It's going to aggravate me. That's the only one I have that's like that. But, yeah, it's really thick really really thick so um let me swirl it over to this side a little bit let you see that way so i'm just giving you some hair porn right now I'm giving you a little bit of hair porn <laughs> is what we call it on the youtubers used to call it back in the day was hair porn um but like i said it's very thick um 
but I'm still loving it. Um, I got frustrated with frustrated for a couple of weeks, and I just kept it tight, kept it um, kept it in a ball and kept it um, ponytails. I ain't do nothing to it, and um, of course, when I was with my family, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't wear my hair out. I tried to wear it out, but it was too hot over there. Like it was burning up. Let me turn y'all down a little bit. It's too bright. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, so um I tried to wear my hair down when I was uh, with my family, but it was too hot. They kept that house that high house was hot as I don't know what. I was like, oh no. We ain't fitting to wear no hair down like this. Like, we ain't fitting to do that. Now that we not doing. So I ended up wearing a ponytail, wearing it back like this, wearing it up, just to get it out the way because it was just too hot. Too hot. I ended up having to wash my hair. I ended up having to come back home and wash my hair one day. See, this one haven't sealed. You see that? That's not sealed yet. Right there. Um, I ended up having to come home and wash my hair one day because my hair was so sweaty from sweating when I was with them. And I always kept on a hat because I ain't want no germs getting in my hair. It was a disaster, y'all. So I ended up washing it one day, coming home and washing it one day and getting that back together so that it could it wouldn't be stained because I ain't want to be my hair to be stained. Uh, y'all know I don't like no stinking hair. So with me, the way I sweat, it, it happens that way for me because I sweat a lot. So I have to consistently wash my hair. Um, I'm a two-week washer hair, <laughs> if that's how you say it. I wash my hair every two weeks. Um, I try to push it to three weeks, but sometimes I don't make it three weeks, depending on how much I sweat. Um, but two weeks is my time frame. Um, as it's getting longer now and thicker, and I'm sweating more because when when I wear it down, I get hot. Um, and with me wearing it down, with not wearing it down, with me, um, with it getting longer and thicker, I noticed that, um, my hair is sweating more. So I ha had to do another wash sooner than my two weeks. Like it's like a week now sometimes. So depending on how much I sweat. Um, but yeah, I, um. It's still doing well, y'all. It's still doing well. She's still hanging in there. She's still doing her thing, y'all. So I just watched her on Monday of this week. And today is Thursday. So I just watched her. Um, yeah. Some of my ends are not sealed yet, as you can see. This one's almost. It's curling up. You can see that little curl up right there. And this one, this one right here, it looked like it's trying to do something. I don't know. I'm going to be honest. I just let it do its thing, y'all. I just let it do its thing and keep it moving. But, yeah, retie time. Um, it was kind of dry, so I made sure I moisturized it today. But it, it wasn't dry today. It was dry um, before I washed my hair. So I did do something different. I used a moisturizing shampoo because my hair felt so dry and hard and I didn't like that feeling. Um, so I went ahead and used a moisturizing shampoo and my hair feels so much better. It feels softer and um, it's good to go now. It's good to go. Um, look at this one, y'all. Y'all see this one? This is definitely matured. Can y'all see that one? Yes. That one's definitely um, maturing. And you see it's starting to go up my lock. I am dealing with a lot of frizziness. And I tied my hair down today. Because um, y'all know I don't tie my hair down when I go to sleep. Every now and then I do. And I sweat. So it ends up coming off. So um, I did tie it up while I was working today. Uh, which is why my roots are so straight right now. As you can see, my roots are very straight right now on top because I tied my hair down while I was working today. So, um, that I did. So, it looks good though. I, I mean, it's a good hair day and I haven't had those 
lately in a while. Um, did I show y'all? Yeah, I think I showed y'all this one. I showed y'all this one. That's the one that's, that's locking really good. I got a lot of short pieces. A lot of them are shrinking up, as you can see back here. Look at this one. This one's shrinking up. My hair is shrinking, but my lot is locking from here. Y'all see that? Um, same. Is it the same one? It's the same one. Here's another one that's doing it too. So back here in these shorter pieces, you see how they're shrinking up back there? Back here, look, look at that one. Same thing, locking from going up. Um, a lot of them back there that are shrunken up are definitely locking. Um, they have definitely matured. So, um, but yeah, that's the hair update. Um, just to let you guys know, y'all know I am two years locked, okay? Two years and some change locked, and um, I'm enjoying it. Um, haven't been doing much with it, but I do see the changing of my hair. My hair is changing a lot. It's changing a whole lot. So, at first, I didn't like the change because it's so thick, but now I'm embracing the change, and I like it, and... Yeah, so that's where my hair is right now. I'm about to put her back in my handy dandy ponytail because, well, actually, I'm getting ready to wash my face, so that's why I'm going to put it in a ponytail. And um, I'm putting in one up so, so that um, I can go ahead and wash this makeup off my face. But I wanted to give you, see how you just do your edges that look like you got a new retie and I didn't do a new retie. So when I retie my hair um, next week or the week after, I'm not going to do my, I'm not going to do my edges. I'm just going to do the other parts of my hair because I already did my edges and I don't want to, my y'all know how I am about edges. So y'all know I'm not going to pull those. So. But anywho, um, don't forget to thumbs up the video. Don't forget to subscribe and be the best you that you can be. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.